Two friends and a chat. Two friends and a chat. Two friends and a chat. <laughs> I'm going to be at the license bureau next week. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Eric. <laughs> <laughs> yeah that's good stuff did you ever tell anybody about the time you broke a chair um no feel free to though okay. I, I you know i regret not mentioning this on felton's i didn't think of it in time though because it was a good spontaneous night that was a good story man yeah you tell the story all right well this one night we were going to uh it was a hell yeah concert wasn't it yeah i believe it was hell yeah it was down in the blue note wasn't it yeah, blue yeah. Note. we were going to hell yeah and you know Alcohol yeah. and ass, mm-hmm. you know that song. Yeah. Oh, that's the only reason I was going. I wanted to hear that song. I loved that song. <laughs> it first came out, and it was just one of those. Just yeah, yeah let's yeah. do this, you know. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we uh, we it's getting to be about the time to head down there, and we uh, go to jump in cars. There was, we had two car loads. He had a car load, and I had a car load, and we were gonna convoy. We got a great big convoy. <laughs> We were headed down there, and it started snowing, like you couldn't, you could hardly, you could probably see four or five feet okay. in front of your car. Right. And I was like, they called me. I said, "Hey, you think maybe we ought to turn around?" I said, "No, I'm going for it." And I was in a Toyota Scion, two wheel drive, light as a feather, not good to be in what we were in. Like, so we got going, and I don't even think they'd left making yet. Mm-mm. No, we got on the outskirts. Yeah. And I got to Excello, and the guy that was with me, he goes, hey, man, this is pretty sketchy. And I said, yeah, I'm not really controlling anything right now. <laughs> 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 like, the, the car was just, I mean, yeah. the, the, the Aston was doing this, and I was just kind of throttling it the whole time, <laughs> just, just turning back and forth, just staring into it the whole time, just having a great time. And I was like... Yeah, this is going to be a long drive down there. I think we probably ought to turn around. <laughs> and it was a good choice either way because, uh, I mean, I, we were going down there for the – I was going down there for the one song, which right. whatever. So we turn around. We end up back at the nickel. We're like, well, let's, let's go to the nickel. Mm-hmm. Meet at the nickel. We'll figure out what we're doing from there. That's what we were doing from there. <laughs> it was like, oh, what are we doing? I don't know. Let's have another beer. All right. Hey, what are we doing? I don't know. Let's have another beer. Yeah, yeah. This was back when the Beaumont was open, too. All right. So then we ended up at the Beaumont. Mm-hmm. Ended up over there, and we met this fellow. He was a strange fellow. <laughs> okay. And Did we meet him at Beaumont? Yes. I thought we met him at Nickel. <clears throat> well, we might have. We might have met him at the Nickel, and we all went over, over, to the Beaumont? went over to the Beaumont. Yeah. And then there was this other guy that was there, and he might have been at the Beaumont already. That might have been what I was thinking of. The hobo. The Remember drifter. The hobo? The yeah. drifter. Yeah. 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 That guy. This guy, he, uh, it was snowing real hard, and he was just so happy to be driving through Macon because we don't have a bypass. <laughs> <laughs> right. And he, uh, you know, he's going through town, and he's like, oh, you know, he stopped at the gas station and asked him if they just had a bar that he could go to for the mm. night. So he head on down. They pointed him down to, the, mm. down to the bar, so he ended up down there, and we met up with this guy, and the next thing we know, the bar's closing down, and we still want to drink. We mm-hmm. got people going to our, like, to my house, and I'm like, okay, we'll see you there. But then we all end up diverting to this guy's house. Like, right. and it was because he's like, oh, my apartment's like right behind this place. Let's go hang out there. Mm-hmm. And this dude was weird, but weird in a good way. Right, right. <laughs> no, you know, opinions vary yeah, on weird in a good way. Fun to, me, fun to be around. No, no, no. No, no, no. He was not fun to be around. No, you see, to me, in a situation when you're out drinking, almost the worst situation is going to be better for you later in life for the story i got you yeah okay so that's why i like whenever things yeah, like bad this things happen. happen so it's like ah screw it let's do this so we go to this we go to this kid's house very well knowing that he might be a serial killer he might not yeah, be whatever <laughs> we take the drifter with us <laughs> <laughs> we could pawn him off which i'm pretty sure is what we did anyway we uh so we go to this guy's house and we're hanging out and drinking his beer and he's got some beers that we're drinking on and mm-hmm. and uh he's got this rocking chair this thing looks like it's from I don't know, 1901. <laughs> and I'm like, I'm just kind of kicking it. And I'm like, man, Sid, have you tried that chair? That's the most comfortable rocking chair I've ever sat in my entire life. Mm-hmm. And he goes, no, I haven't. And he just plops down in it and the thing just breaks into a thousand pieces. Just. <laughs> 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 and, I, and I immediately started in on him. I was like, dude, 
dude, that was that guy's like grandma's rocking chair, dude. He's gonna be so mad. And he's like trying to find blankets to throw on it and everything. Else. No way he's gonna he's gonna notice. Yeah. There's no way he's not gonna notice this missing rocking chair. But we were so fucked up, man. We were gone. Yeah. And then we ended up. You guys uh, just ran out? No, no, no. It, oh. get, it gets more oh. interesting. Oh, okay. So. He sets us down, and him and this fellow start start toking up. Mm. And, you know, nothing out of the ordinary there, partying with some weird people. Mm. Yeah, toke on up. I don't give a crap. So they're toking up, and he's like, hey, hold on. My girlfriend's calling. <laughs> <laughs> now, I should say she was, like, Skyping him. Is that what, is that what she was doing? I think it was time? Skype, something like that. Some yeah. weird mm-hmm. internet deal. Well, she was Australian. Mm-hmm. <laughs> So you could hear it was from Australia, oh, okay. and like the dude legit like was. Do you remember that part of the story? She he, he like legit kissed the computer screen. I remember that. Oh damn! Oh, I can okay. still see that. So it wasn't even on the cell phone. It was on the computer. Okay. It was back in okay. his room, okay. right? Okay. Yeah, gotcha. it was back in his room, and we all went in there. And didn't she get mad because there was like a, a house full of people? Well, and we, had, we had Pink Floyd playing, and I don't know what was going on. <laughs> she could probably see the marijuana smoke in the background. <laughs> It was wild. Yeah. Uh, so she wasn't just visiting Australia. She's from Australia. Yeah, she yeah. was an Aussie. Okay. They'd never met in person before. Okay. Yeah. Type deal. Mm-hmm. You know. Mm-hmm. Well, and then uh, what happened when, I mean, didn't you see that fellow at the, the local Casey's not that long ago? And he asked, he thought he recognized you. Um. Yeah, yeah. I think, yeah, yeah, yeah. He said that. And I was like, yeah. I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> they kind of whisper on my way out. Sorry about your chair. <laughs> oh, that was a great night. Yeah. Then we ended up back at back at my house. We left the drifter there. We ended up at my house drinking drinking more beer. Yeah, we almost fell down the stairs though because all yeah, the snow. It's it had snowed a lot. You know, it stopped snowing at that point. But yeah, that was a good night. I was so hungover the next day. <laughs> I remember that most vividly. Is that the night that I climbed in your guys' bed? Yes. Yeah, yes. I thought so. Because you had a house full of people staying the night with you. Mm-hmm. And I went to the, I got up in the middle of the night, went to the bathroom, and I was still so fucked up. I make it, I'm trying to make it back to the living room. I'm sleeping on his couch. I climb in bed with him and his wife. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. I wake up. I wake up, and I was like 7 o'clock in the morning. I'm at the foot of their bed. Feet, <laughs> feet in my face. I'm like, well, this doesn't seem right. <laughs> so we, Wow. <laughs> yeah. Good times, man. Good times. All right. That's enough for this episode, man. Uh, I think we're going to do another one right now with, with AJ. Uh, it's going to be like a week difference on on YouTube. But uh, AJ, yeah, let's end this, and we're going we're gonna to get started with another one. Sounds good. Eric, you got anything to say? Nope. All right. Thanks for watching. Later. Yeah, she doesn't want to say goodbye, so we're just going to end it.